Hello, and this is Tony G from Ocean Hut Surf Shop, and today we're going to talk about the Channel Island new flyer. I was a big fan of the flyer. The original model was excellent in all kinds of waves, and this one follows suit. Uh, it's got a pretty good dome deck. They want to put more volume in this board, so through the center strip you have a lot more volume, and then you have a thinning of the rail uh, on both sides. A fairly normal nose. This is pretty much a standard shortboard with a wider outline. It's got a serious bump right at the front fins into a nice tight squash tail. The rails are tucked under very cleanly. There's a little bit more exit rocker, but a flatter nose rocker. And as we put the board on its rail, you can see there's a really good outline with that bump right at the front fins going into the nose. The bottom is a double concave all the way through the fin cluster into V outside all the fins going into a single concave. So really what they've done is they've built a single concave and put a double inside it. All the boards are set up in five fins so you can ride this board many different ways. I've been out at Rincon and watched Bobby Martinez ride this board in a 5.8 and do a hell of a job on it. The entry rocker is a little softer here, so you're going to catch the wave a little earlier. There's a good clean flat section, and there's a lot of release as we talk about that bump in the outline at the front fins. So allow the board to carve in the pocket. This is the Al Merrick New Flyer. It's very nice. Stop by and take a look.